But under this video, you'll know exactly how to set up your LinkedIn credentials inside NARN. So you can start automating your content, lead gen, and outreach. So let me show you how this plays out in real life. So imagine this, you're building a LinkedIn automation that posts content every day, but it keeps failing because your credentials aren't set up properly. Well, in this video, we're going to fix that permanently. Welcome back to the channel, guys. My name is Saeed, and this is where AI meets real world action. If you're trying to keep up with all the tech, simplify how you work, or just finally understand how this AI automation stuff works, you're in the right place. To dive deeper and learn more, click on the link in the bio. You'll find everything there. All right, so now let's dive in step by step. Quick overview of the requirements that NADN wants to create your credentials. So you must, of course, have a personal LinkedIn page. This is mine. And you must also have a company LinkedIn page. So now for the second step, we're going to go into your NADN. We're going to create a new workflow. We're going to add the first step and we're going to type in LinkedIn. We're going to create a new post or create a post node. And here, as you can see, I already have one set up, but I'll set up another one for the sake of this video. And we're going to be popped with this. So we need a client ID and we need a client secret. Now, where do we get this from? We're going to head into Google and we're going to type in LinkedIn developer. It should be the first link that pops up. We're going to create an app and we're going to name it, for example, I'm going to name it for NADN. Let's call it NADN. Now you need to put in your LinkedIn company page URL here, not your personal, your company. Now how we're going to get this URL here is by going back to your LinkedIn page, click on your company's page, and we're going to view it as a member. And now once here, you're going to copy this link, everything before the before the view is member true. And you're going to copy that and go back to create apps and you're going to paste that link there. All right, and you're going to see it pop up. If it doesn't pop up, you have the wrong URL. Now, the private policy URL, you don't need that. Next, we need to go into here. You need to upload a logo. So, for example, I'm going to use my company logo for this one. So, I'm going to go into logos and I'm going to upload this one, for example. Once that's done, I'm going to have to agree on the terms and we're going to click create app. So, now we need to enable APIs for your LinkedIn. So, if you're on settings here, you need to go into products. It should already pop up in products. You need to share on LinkedIn. You need to request access. And I say, yes, I'm requesting access. All right, now that's done. We need to scroll down and go into sign in with LinkedIn using OpenAI or OpenID Connect. Request access. And we're going to say, yes, request access. Once we have that portion set up, we're going to go into auth here and you're going to copy this client ID and primary client secret. So this is what NIN was asking us for. So client ID, and we are going to copy the secret. And over here, we organize support. We don't need that. Whether to request permission to post as an organization, no, we don't need that. And legacy, whether to use a legacy API, we don't need that either. Now, before we continue and, con and click connect my account down here, now before we click connect my account, there's one more thing we need to do. Over here, we need to click copy this. We need to go back into the... LinkedIn developers, and we need to go into AAuth 2.0 settings and set this up. So we need to add a redirect URL, paste that into there, and update that. Go back into NADN and connect, and you should be prompted to log into your account, and you're going to sign in. It's going to prompt you that LinkedIn wants to connect, and we're going to wait for that to load, and we're going to click allow. Now, of course, I got an error on setting this up because I already linked it into another account. But if everything goes good, you should get a green and you should be good to go. 